guys, Mariah DeVita here. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the Juvia's Place Natural Radiance Foundation. Um, I have used this foundation before, the original, the I Am Magic Velvety Matte Foundation. When I first used this, I tried the shade Rio. I bought two bottles, finished those. And then recently, I repurchased the foundation in a new shade Punta Cana 435 and that was the better matching foundation so I got the same shade in this which is um 435 Punta Cana and to be honest for this particular foundation um the shade match is pretty similar this one is just a tad bit lighter um but I have noticed that other shades in this range are a little bit different than the ones that um are in the velvety matte one and I know that Juvia's Place commented on their on their Instagram page um, because somebody had asked if there are a shade in the original foundation is it going to correlate to the new foundation and they said it is pretty similar so just kind of bear in mind if you have a Ulta that you can go to I would definitely recommend going into the store and swatching before buying but I'm in Canada I don't have that luxury I had to look online so I just I went with the same one and luckily enough it worked out so if you would like to see my initial um impression and also the wear test then definitely keep on watching okay <clears throat> so i'm all color corrected i have my damp sponge i've shaken up the foundation and i'm just going to do three pumps onto my palette and we're going to go in on one side of my face so the color is good as you guys can see, it's blending in. This has like a tropical kind of like fruity smell and I'm not mad at it. It smells really good. So, so far so good. It feels good on my skin. The coverage to me, this looks like full coverage. Honestly, this is, this is pretty full coverage. It does say it's medium. So, but this is pretty full coverage to me. Just some on my forehead. I want to make sure I'm getting into my hairline. So I'm just going to do the rest of my face and I'm going to come back and show you what it looks like. So I'm up close and personal in your face. This is the foundation. I don't have any concealer on. And I love how my skin looks right now. It looks healthy and glowy. I love the color match. I think the color match is good. Um, and I just like how it just, I like how it feels. Because it doesn't feel like anything, to be honest. Love how it smells. So far, so good. This looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and do the remainder of my face. And give you guys my first impressions. This is my makeup done. Um... I did my eyes with Juvia's Place eyeshadow palettes, the Nomad and Nubian Earth. And then I'm wearing Juvia's Place, the Nile lipstick with Oasis lip gloss on top. I have Juvia's Place bronzer, blush. I'm just Juvia's Place decked out today for the foundation, um, for the face. So this foundation is beautiful. My initial impression is that the color match is good. Um... The coverage is great. I personally think the coverage is, is full. Um, I didn't do a second layer to see if it, you could build it into, like, if, if it looks cakey. Because I just personally feel like the one layer was good enough. And everything's, like, covered. There was no weird skipping. This is a hydrating foundation. So, so far, so good. I am pleased. We're just going to see how the foundation wears. So, I will definitely check back in at the end of the day after eight hours and let you guys know how this foundation performs so the verdict is in okay we are going to disregard the makeup here this is from my eyeshadow I'm not really sure why this tends to happen i need to figure that out that's really irritating um we're gonna focus on the foundation i have not touched up my lips um again i did touch it up after i ate earlier but i have this i haven't touched up there's nothing really on my lips right now so let's get in close nose area mouth chin the glow 
honestly, I think this foundation for being what it is, um, natural radiant, this whole held up on my skin really well. I have oily combination skin. There is glow, obviously, on my forehead. That tends to happen with my foundation. I definitely would have expected more glow in my lower T-zone. So, like, my cheeks, my nose, and my chin. Um, but it's actually not crazy. There is a little bit of a glow. But if I just lightly tap some powder on that, it would look brand new. And just obviously, obviously fixed, fixed my eye corners. Um, yeah. I think this foundation wore really well. There is a little bit of wear on my mouth and around my nose, a little bit on my chin. Very minimal though, like extremely minimal. Um, if I dusted powder, you wouldn't even be able to tell, honestly. Um, that's how like minimal it is. Definitely performed better than the Makeup by Mario. And I'm comparing it to that foundation because that's the foundation that I put on prior to this one that I recently, you know, tried this is previous video and so considering that both of those foundations are claiming to be radiant and like hydrating and medium to full coverage and definitely the better choice out of the two um i would give this an 8.5 out of 10 i recently rated my foundation collection on tiktok and i uh rated the juvia's place foundation 9.5 out of 10 so this would just be a notch below it it's very beautiful love it Shade match is, is good, and the wear. Um, I just, obviously, this is a better contender to hold up on oily or oily combination skin, so. But other than that, it's beautiful. I personally love the scent, love how it feels on the skin, and it photographs beautifully, so I'm here for it. Um, hopefully that helps you make a little bit more of an informed decision. I would still recommend if you are able to go to an Ulta, go inside the store, give it a swatch. If not, make your best, you know, educated guess on what your shade would be. Um, do the research, maybe try and find somebody who's like a shade buddy, similar to your shade, and then go from there. Um, so yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new to my channel, please definitely join the family up, share this video with a friend, and subscribe. I will see you guys in another video. Bye, loves.